Hey, I'm Steve. Today we're checking out the Salt Dog SHPE series of spreaders from Byers Products. The SHPE is available in four sizes to accommodate vehicles from UTVs to one-ton pickups. Capacities range from 0.75 cubic yards to 2 cubic yards. They can spread bulk salt or a 50-50 salt sand mix. All sizes are available with extended chutes to accommodate taller vehicles. SHPEs feature patented double-walled poly hoppers. They're super sturdy and will never rust or corrode. Two integral baffles on the smaller models help reduce stress on the auger to optimize material flow and reduce the risk of jamming. These baffles are adjustable to accommodate a variety of spreading materials. The two cubic yard model features a stainless steel inverted V instead. Same effect, just a slightly different design to handle the higher capacity. The spreaders use low maintenance electric drives with independent motors for the auger and spinner. These are great because they don't require fuel and they run quieter than gas motors. A half horsepower motor powers the 2.5 inch stainless steel auger. This works in conjunction with the included 200 pound vibrator to provide smooth, consistent material flow. If the spreader does get jammed, the auger automatically reverses up to three times to help clear the clog. The 14 inch poly spinner is powered by its own quarter horsepower motor. It spreads material 5 to 30 feet, and an adjustable deflector helps direct the spread pattern to best suit your needs. The adjustable chute can be moved forward or back to better accommodate different weight materials. The entire spinner assembly is also removable for easy cleaning. Intuitive in-cab controls let you precisely manage your spreading with independent auger and spinner speed settings and a vibrator on-off switch. To round out the package, every SHP spreader comes standard with a bunch of useful accessories. Tie-downs are included to help secure your spreader to your vehicle. A top screen helps break up clumps of material during loading, and a fitted tarp keeps the inside of your hopper dry and protected between uses. A remote auger bearing grease kit makes it easy to keep your spreader operating at peak performance. Thanks for checking out the Salt Dog SHPE series of spreaders from Byers Products. Visit buyersproducts.com for more information. I'm Steve. Today we're looking at the different adjustments you can make on the shoot of your Salt Dog SHP series spreader from Byers Products. These adjustments can have a huge impact on how effectively and efficiently your spreader does its job. When you're out fighting a snowstorm, you need your spreader loaded with the right type of material. But different materials have different weights, and trying to use a one-size-fits-all approach to your spreader settings will lead to suboptimal coverage and wasted resources. The heavier the material you're using, the closer to the center of the spinner you want it to land. The same way you need more wind-up to throw a boulder than a baseball. Your spreader needs more wind-up to properly throw heavier materials like bulk sand or salt sand mixes. Using the wrong setting for your given material can cause it to be flung too far or not far enough. That affects both the quality of your work and your bottom line. The chute on your SHP has three sets of holes on either side. These holes allow you to adjust your chute closer or further from your truck, changing where material falls in your spinner. The set of holes closest to the cab are perfect for lighter materials like calcium chloride. The middle holes should be used for bulk salt or things around the same weight. And the holes farthest from the cab are for heavier materials like salt sand mixes. To reposition the chute, just remove the screws, washers, and nuts, line up the bracket in the desired position, and put the hardware back in. Simple as that. You can also easily change the direction your spreader is distributing its material using the thumb screws on the back of the chute. This lets you direct your material spread directly behind you or to either side, giving you the flexibility you need to get the job done. Loosen the screws until you can freely adjust the spinner shield, then position it so it'll guide your material where you want it. If you're looking for a passenger side spray, for example, you want to position the shield towards the driver's side of your vehicle. Once the shield is where you want it, just tighten the screws back down and you're good to go. These two adjustments are fast and easy to do, and can save you a lot of time, material, and frustration. Thanks for checking out how to get the most out of your Salt Dog SHP series spreader from Byers Products. Visit buyersproducts.com for more information and to see our full line of spreaders and spreader accessories.